Thank you for tuning in to the Pointless Talks podcast. This episode is being brought to you as a part of the many things that Pointless creates. For our returning listeners, thank you so much for coming back. And if this is your first episode, welcome, get comfortable, and please keep an open mind. Hello. Yo, yo, yo. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Um, me, I tell welcome? I people to me, I tell No, welcome. the people them. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Yo, greetings, people. Not a nice greetings, greetings. Yes. Um. So my brother said our episodes be too long, so we're gonna try and keep this under two hours. Look here, look here, look here, look here, look here. When things are the top, but we need the top, but that's why. Listen, I told him I was like, we haven't recorded in like two years. What do you expect? Like, we have things to talk about. Like, honestly, come on, brother. Enough something not going. Give me a give me give me a pass. Give me a pass. For real, but yeah. So. The first something I want to touch on, I don't know, we didn't even talk about this. I just realized I opened up to something and see it. You hear about the um trans girl that won the um NCAA swimming champ? Is this the thing that Boosie was talking about? I don't subscribe to that man, about? but probably. I don't know, because you know he's obsessed with the LGBTQIA blah 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 community. He's obsessed, I, so no, I wouldn't no, be surprised. No. Don't you sit there and talk about blah blah blah. Don't do that. You cannot I said blah, all blah, of them. Blah. You cannot do blah 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 because then people <laughs> think it's okay for them to do blah blah blah. And I said LGBTQIA plus. There we go. I appreciate that. Thank you. Uh, sorry uh, for my people. Mm. <laughs> I feel your one people them. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> so <laughs> the girl win what is it five hundred yard freestyle right? Mm-hmm. And of course, everybody is outraged, standing strong in their transphobia. Like the comments are ridiculous. Like, of course, a man won the race, and I'm like, damn, damn. Like, and then people talk about some. Imagine working so hard to win, and you come, you come second to a man. Like they're like going in in the comments, and I'm like, bruh, like. I want to say I heard about it, but I don't know. Like, I don't know the age group. I don't know. Okay. It's college. Let me see if I have the age. I'm not so sure. So college. And it's mm-hmm. a, it's M to F, F to M? M to F. Okay. Yeah. So. Well, obviously. How did it think, and one? Yeah. That I think, is it Penn State? I don't know. But. Um, okay. Her name is Leo Thomas. And. She's the first known transgender athlete to win an NCAA division championship in any sport. Shit. Okay, man. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, you know when it comes to trans, UPenn. yeah, mm-hmm. tr- when it comes to trans issues and their fight, you know what I'm saying, and the mm-hmm. things they're trying to do, it's a lot with it. Yeah, it goes a lot deeper than okay. Well, I'm gay. I'm a lesbian because yeah, we're you know we're not involving us in the whole body part. Like I'm not changing mm-hmm. anything. I'm not trying to whatever, or I don't think I'm this and that. I yeah, you know. Uh, you Listen, know, I'm not even asking for opinion. I'm just spreading the word because no, no, I mean, no, you're not my opinion. No, but me got talk. Okay, but I don't Hold know. Hold on, like before you start, though, let why? me let me read something else to you because this is what caught my attention off the rip. Yeah, yeah. So, from the Daily Mail, <clears throat> mm-hmm. one of the teammates said. We're uncomfortable in our own locker room. Leah Thomas, UPenn's teammate, tells how the trans swimmer doesn't always cover up her male genitals when changing and their concern goes ignored by their coach. Ooh. McCantha, no? Yeah, go on. Okay. So basically, she, mm-hmm. when she had changed in her locker room, I saw our, our parts, them outside. Mm-hmm. No, me not believe in that. <laughs> me not believe in that still. Listen, yeah. I'm here for whatever. You know, I mean, mm-hmm. you know, I'm not like police things. But if you say, you're up on the girls team, right? Mm-hmm. You call my in that girls, I can remind you up on the girls team. There is no way you're something them supposed to outside that jiggle up on them in a girl's locker room. I lie. I don't like me I tell. I feel the same way. Yeah, that's not, not, that not right. You forgot to like, pick a side, that's all. Listen, talk, baby, talk. Like, yeah, talk our role. Like, whether you identify as X, Y, Z, they don't want to see that in the yeah, in the locker right. room. That is distracting. Whether you are, even if it was a cis cishet, cishet male, even if it was a man, just a man walking around with his dick hanging out, they're that's gonna be like, "What the okay f-? either way?" Yeah, exactly. Well. That's what I'm saying. Either way, it's like 
But yeah, that's what I have to say. You have to pick a side. You can't say, all right, I'm going to woman team. I'm going to assume that a bunch of women, I'm going to win the woman title, whatever. Ray, 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 ray. But you know, like a room with this in the mouth of the world. <laughs> no, yeah. man. No, bro. I, sis, no disrespect. I, no, that part can't rock. The, um, They might need their own separate locker room. We're not mm-hmm. going. I'm, yeah, that's a bit. That's very. That's Or mm. at least, like I said, tuck. Like, put on some underwear when you're not, like, turn your back to the people. Hold on. They, you just... said they in college. This is college? Yes. Mm, nah. Absolutely not. Yes. Absolutely not. I don't you know, care. So my mother would have done that long time. Yeah, I don't I don't like that. I don't like the idea. I'm all the yeah. way here for people being able to do the things that, you know, mm-hmm. and play the sports they want to play and be accepted and all that stuff. I'm all for that. But that is kind of... That's mm-hmm. a bit much. Nobody it wants is. to see, nobody wants to see a pot. I mean, I like a room. Girl. Yeah. And it's just... They're going to be like, oh, what, because it's different? Y- yes. Yes, that's exactly what it is. And I know there's people that's going to be like, oh, you're being... No, like, think about it from a rational standpoint. So, like I said specifically, like if it was a cis gendered male outrage. that was in the room, it would outrage. be the, exactly. It's not even about they're trying to touch you or they're trying to do anything. It's just nobody don't want to see your dick. Yeah, <laughs> like that's it. Nobody don't want to see your dick. I'm like dead son. All right, so yeah, because it's like, and then it's gonna be a discriminatory thing. Oh, why do I have to go on a different route, bitch? You know goddamn well why. Don't do that. No, I hear people play fool for catch wise and try to do stupidness. Like, don't do that. Like, I'm, I'm kinda... all for equality and inclusivity and all of that. But if you just being all willy nilly, literally willy nilly, in the people that locker room, like <laughs> uh, not willy nilly, no, <laughs> like <laughs> not willy nilly. Somebody's gonna be uncomfortable. Like, not everybody wants to see that. And granted, they're not there to look at it, but parts are moving. My thing is. We talking about we ain't talking about middle school. We ain't Mm-mm. talking about high school. We talking about college. Mm-hmm. And you talking about a grown person. You supposed to know how to tuck your parts and whatever to make exactly. it presentable and make it right if you won't be around these on the woman's team as a woman yourself, mm-hmm. right? Like you supposed to know how to deal with your stuff. You should have listen, I'm sure you know how to tuck. Tuck I'm your sure. Role. Yeah, exactly. Nah. Yeah. Um mm. Mm-mm. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not really too did like that. I saw it like I'm oh, not no. here for any of the homophobic or transphobic comments of them Thanks. like doing the whole gender blah 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 whatever. Oh, but like when it when I saw that article, I was like, bruh, what? Yeah, like yeah, you almost had me, man. You almost had me. <laughs> like, <laughs> you almost had me. <laughs> yeah, until you realize the people dick is out. No, yeah, you being careless. Like you just. And you know what's no. kind of scary? Cause je- like a lot of people I know when they um when they're like transitioning or whatever, mm-hmm. it's changing. They don't you don't really want to see it. They don't really that let it exactly be or out yes. and about people being able to acknowledge the fact mm-hmm. that what they once were, what they were born as, because yep. they're trying to step, you know, do their whole yeah. new thing, change who they that. are. So it's kind of funny to say it's just out here running around the locker room, mm-hmm. just peeking and shit when. Yeah. But then again, my thing is, I don't think I know any trans woman. I do know a trans woman, but like, not like enough to know about her genitalia. You get me? So like, I know a lot of trans men, though, who would definitely feel that way. Like you said, like they don't want they don't even want their vaginal Listen, region. My to dogs be... is my dogs is not showing their pum pum. Exactly. Pum-pum at Rashi all. Pum pum weird strip. Listen. Oh, I have <laughs> you, Aggie. I had one person that I followed way back in the day on Tumblr who was documenting their transition. And that's the only time like they would show like, you know, how testosterone affected like their clit and how it like enlarged and like Nigga. the whole change. And I was like, it's a mini penis. Listen. But like Yeah. Because but other than that though, something we call them. We didn't take you the others. We call it. We call it. <laughs> <laughs> What are you? What are you picking up blanket? I hate you so much. I knew that's what you was gonna say. <laughs> about as big as a pig in a blanket. Yeah, man, that shit is different. Oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, I saw the something name. But yeah. I just wanted to bring that up because I thought that was interesting. We can switch to something much lighter now because okay. um All right. so that heavy. It's, 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 when I say it heavy, it's just. Is it controversial? Uh, depending on who you ask. Oh, okay. Well, 
we ain't never care. We just keep it <laughs> exactly. the way we do. So that's just gonna be that on that. Yeah. So apparently, um, America's trying to get rid of daylight savings. Yeah. You know. <laughs> Whatever. First of all, I thought it was only America did it, but it's a bunch of other countries that actually like observe Observed. daylight savings. Correct. And I was like, huh. Mm-hmm. Imagine that. Like apparently some parts of America doesn't even do it and some parts of it. Canada don't do it. And I'm like, correct. <sighs> like why? Like Girl, right now, point. what are we? An hour ahead of Jamaica right now? And it's like, I'm trying to figure out are they going to change it so that we stay on this time or that we go back to the other time? It's like you imagine at this point, I I think now it would stay now, like now I guess it would just stay here. Is that and what it would be? Again. I'm thinking mm-hmm. so. I don't know, cause right now we're ahead of Jamaica. Yeah, I was thinking like you know we would be like on the same time zone as Jamaica. That would make my life a little bit easier. That make you feel better? A little bit, just a little bit. Dog. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> if they want to keep it, flip it, turn it, reverse it at this point. It really don't ahead. matter. I just yeah, hate I the whole give a damn chop, clock point. changing foolishness. I just don't give a damn at this point. I mean, I'm still getting used to it being light outside and like six again. So I like it because I'm <laughs> driving home and it's not dark. This is also true. I love that for you. But mm-hmm. yeah, I guess it's co- it don't even matter sometimes, though. It don't matter to me sometimes, but I guess I guess I like the days where it's still like light and outside and mm-hmm. it's not as dark and you can still kind of feel like the days longer. Know what I mean, yeah, that's the only thing I like about it. Um, but since daylight savings, mm-hmm. when um, Jamaica lift and curfew, listen, I'll pat Kovalik. Listen, <laughs> you know my baby father, um, bootleg rock star. Don't do that. Sorry, don't do that. Sorry. Boot like rock star, my boo. Oh, his yes. beautiful, beautiful. Uh, Jeez. I stand him like uh, yeah, yeah. Every time, mine, mine. but no, he he tweeted and he was like, Jamaica opened up like some gal where I make hand miggle. I was like, huh? <laughs> whoa. Yo, one thing I don't know can do you know style it. Yo, I was weak. I was like, but yes, because. Why Jamaica's not creative? They were, huh? They were open before, but mm-hmm. we had speaking That's up. It. Speaking of this open up business, mm-hmm. you did I go say something else? No, me spill, almost spill my wine. Gotcha. All right. So it looked like <laughs> it looked like it really opened up. Everybody get the message because from week start, everybody there Jamaica. <clears throat> mm-hmm. Everybody. I know two people who was in girl, Jamaica over weekend. Girl, this is some good When I come trick. from yard, I'm not a bad mind on them. I'm just saying. say, <laughs> what I'm finesse? Listen. The, not, 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 not that finesse. No. Whoa, whoa. The finesse whoa, that was really? on the show. Whoa, from, baby. <laughs> whoa, No. <laughs> Yo, all right. Okay. Okay. I'm glad we on. Girl, I was about to say. All right. No. I was about to listen. I don't know, nigga. Nigga, I'll chuck off. Disconnect, nigga. I don't know. Mm-hmm. However, yeah, everybody. I'm gonna keep Jamaica. up with Cabra. <laughs> yeah. Everybody, Jamaica. I'm jealous. I'm jealous. Jealous no. bad. Dog. Dog. <laughs> like... Jealous bad. Listen, now go online. I'll go, you know what? I'm gonna go renew my passport, yeah? Let's go, friend. Need I have my US it. passport. Okay. That's 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 okay, but you know, someone I like travel with that. That I know. Mm-hmm. That I know. All right, go well, on, go stand up in our resident line. True. Let's see the place <laughs> open up. Mm-hmm. Let me see how these things are going. And then as as the place are open up, let this thing. Let me tell it. What me say the other day about the grinder situation. Oh yes. So listen. One of these lovely American tourists decides say, "I'm go to Jamaica." Mm-hmm. And he might go do the link up on him up. We would have talked about. And um, he link up with this guy. The guy come on my hotel. Well, it was two guys who come on my hotel. It looked like. No, Think, sir. Yeah, things and things are going on. He end up I give somebody oral. By the time he mm-hmm. looking, he can't find him phone. Oh. By the time he notes again, he start beating him up. Forget him pin number them or something. Then him phone, them teeth him this, them teeth him that. And get away. Hmm. Um, 
listen, men will say things where's, open up again. Where's where is the, the comment that I Oh, where's the comment? Yo, there's we a can't comment. go on people comments, about these, these kind of situations, yeah, it's kinda no. ignorant. No, it 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 it's ignorant, but them well, where did it go? But I would like to say, if you know what I'll do. Mm-hmm. Y'all gotta know what y'all doing and where you're doing it. Mm-hmm. Like I know things gonna start opening up again. Like people, yo, be careful. Be careful, be careful, be careful of who you're trying to meet up with. Be careful of the drugs y'all trying to take in these different places that y'all going to. Be careful who you linking up with, who car you getting into, who bet you know, all that, like, yes. just be careful. No, somebody said, at a, um, undercover man them. Because mm. my thing is, at the end of the day, you were getting head from him. This is what I'm saying. Somebody was getting head. So somebody into something. Because why were you on Grindr to begin with? My understanding is that scam and them something there, but you get to the point where you actually pull out your something. First of all, your pee-pee was hard. Yikes. You were enjoying it. Yikes. Yikes. Even if it never did too good, something got you excited. And Yikes. listen, I know Yikes. heterosexual men, and that's something not going to keep. It's not getting hard. So it's okay. Come out the closet. Y'all are so homophobic within yourselves. Like, what What, what are you proving? To who? My and the next is. one, my thing, the next one, just stand up there and watch. I like, don't know. That one that looked like he was busy stealing everything in oh, the process. Oh, while the next this one, one I... was getting serviced. You feel fucking what I'm idiots. But my thing is, I need people to be safe. Like you, you in a place that you're not from, right? You from America. Yeah. You're an American tourist, and then you're taking yourself. You going to Jamaica? Like, let's not play dumb. All right, <laughs> let's. I not. mean, things are not like they once were, but things. You know how Jamaica is about. It's still. Things. Let's not play games. Yeah. But you decide to go out there, and now you on this app over here. You all here looking for man. Rasta, them not put a yard, a, a foreign. The man say more, you know. Them no want to itty mini titty mini. Man say more, you know, some things. So, but it's just too much. Like, cause you could that could have really went a whole different way. Yeah, and it could have. Could I not live for tell it? Yeah, yeah, could I kill him? Yeah, that. But I bet he thought he was safe because they was coming to the hotel. You feel me? Stupid. It's not like he was leaving like they care. to go meet up with them somewhere. Exactly. They come no, in the hotel, so come rob your said with The fact that it's two of them you met come in our room one time with you one were in you there. In a, yeah, that, were you in a? Be, yeah. Were you in her? Yeah. I mean, I hey, mean, I I'm going to knock nobody out with them carry on with, but you don't know them from a hole in the wall. Yeah, you know, yes, it, yeah that's my thing. Yeah. Two people one time. I come in our room. No, something wrong. That's Neither wrong. one of them that you know. You ain't been in the country that damn long. No. No, like had not known these people, like legit was on Grinder or whatever. That's the gay one, Grinder. Yeah. Yeah, they pan it a scan, scan, I must see match up or whatever. With, I don't know where it go. And I talk to the person, and the person say, yo, me there, I saw him say, yo, you saw link up, link up. See him where you saw. Go long, I lobby, go meet them all, them something there. But they might eat that too, you know, for rob him and make him live for the Excuse Ex- me. That sound, yeah, bad. sorry to say but that, you know but it's I'm true. Saying, because they can't hotel, identify you. Hotel, hotel, camera, all them something in our lobby. Now, yeah. Mm-hmm. So even that no makes sense. Exactly. Even but if it's a but, fake name where you use, but, them still can't put up your picture and say, hey, but that you know. Jamaica, but that Jamaica can't happen. So only guys exactly. know what happened with all that. JCF now do not know that. Yeah, that guy not the end of 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 the Listen, they say how JCF, the police boy, them broke now because they used to catch fee mm-hmm. at night time when people them miss curfew. Mm-hmm. <laughs> they said they're not the money are coming you now since Jamaica opened up. Fact. Listen, we, didn't we give them uh, disclaimers the last time we was talking about traveling to different countries? Like, y'all y'all don't listen. We did the last time. We did say be careful <laughs> of how you traveling, when you traveling, being aware and all of that stuff, yeah. Uh-oh. I don't know. I don't know how some people do it. I, I can't go nowhere and not be alert and, and making sense of what I'm doing. You you always have to remember, like, you're not from some, a lot of the places you Even go, if it's somewhere I, I'm from, even where, I go home and I'm on high alert. Being, on, being alert, it's, it's, it's just what it is. Yeah. Especially if you're home. Mm-hmm. But people don't understand it. But I need people to get it together. Like for this, like summer coming up, I see the weather. We outside. At, at, at. I need y'all Listen. to be safe and alert and know what y'all doing. And, but and um, no drinking and driving, please, because oh baby, okay, okay, okay. So I can attest that I have definitely had my share of drinking and driving. However, 
Correct. Whenever I go anywhere and the people I'm rolling with are driving, I take it upon myself to make sure that I don't drink too much. Because in fact. case anybody else drink too much, I am making sure me and everybody else reach home safe because nobody might not call me. I say, I can test the You know lying. what I'm saying? So like, even if it's something that's like, it's never something that's discussed. I'm just all, I have control problems. I need to make sure that everybody get home safe. I am the mother bear. Like, you know right. what I'm saying? So it's like, Oh, y'all niggas having a great time. I'm going to have a good time too. When the night start, the window don't look a bit though. If you, Mrs. and nobody not sweat and not dance up, no look away them drink and people not stand up straight. And, no, no, no. Give me the key. Give me the key. I, I got it. I go drink some water, go peep a couple of time. Mm -hmm. No, we're not playing them games. My thing is, I know we've all, like, everyone can testify to having a story of going yeah. out with your friends and, and you know, y'all yeah. maybe just a little bit, you know, yeah. you're not supposed to be driving. Yeah, but, you, know, you say a little prayer and we and we hit that yeah. move and we gotta go. <laughs> we do what we do. It's not safe, and mm -hmm. thank God that you know everybody has survived all those times that they did these mm -hmm. reckless things. But, but <laughs> some people this don't know shit, when them get blessing. This shit is just a little bit fucking different. Okay. Yeah, because. <sighs> How about, like i make jokes all the time saying that i drive better when i'm drunk right mm -hmm. because honest to god i the cfs driving you ever catch me do right one made up on the speed limit head up on it might mm -hmm. be a little bit below it right. i'll indicate i mean i use my indicators regardless but i'll indicate i use me i wait yeah. me I, you know come yeah. to a full stop a stop yeah. sign you driving the way you're supposed to be driving yes <laughs> yes i'm obeying all the limits law. in law uh -huh. okay yes Y'all bought what, hundred and something in a fifty? Yeah, she was doing like hundred and ten in a fifty mile per hour. Yo, and then I can't, but I just, bro, kind of catch our fear speed, right? They First of her. all, that whole thing is, you got pulled over for speeding, right? Bomb, yes. stop right there, so. I don't know if the police officer even get to the window. I don't know the full story. Like, I didn't look into it, look into it, but from the stuff that I'm seeing online, I don't know if the police officer got to the window and spoke to her because. If you flying like that, you smell like alcohol. Definitely. You smell like alcohol. I don't know. I don't know if he did see her or if he was on his way out the car or, or whatever. whatever. But either way, he got a call about somebody up the road, a pedestrian on the interstate or whatever. Right. So somebody yes. walking on the highway. Correct. Right. So them say, all right, girl, go on by your business. We have an emergency. Right. To, right? Mm -hmm. I understand that. The girl sit down there and go tweet. Yo, tweeted, son. Bruh. Girl, pick up our phone and tweet, say, she's the best drunk driver, Ray Tay Tay. In those few minutes, my nigga. Two, two, she start drive again. Right. Go book up in IP with them, the same police officer would let her go. And kill them and the man would then go fine. So Girl. Jesus Christ. Just, you gonna give, can you give for those... Who needs a <sighs> translation? Are you gonna translate? Okay, so, sorry. <laughs> what? That shit, no, nah, that shit fucked me up though. So, so yeah, she did a little tweet talking about, you know, I'm the best drunk driver ever. Then decide, okay, time to pull off. I'm about to get back to it. Yep. I start speeding again, basically, because there's no way you were going to speed limit. And you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. and crashed into the two officers that pulled her over and, and the, the pedestrian that they went to go like that they got the call for yeah that they got the call for i ain't seen and killed the, all three uh, of them that is probably the quickest gotcha bitch in history like somebody said you got the uh, the legit epitome of a get out of jail free card. card yeah but because you're nasty what you getting on twitter for talking about ah, bah, bah, bah. like my thing is you seen that the cop went the way and you still gonna speed your ass the same way i don't listen there was in the comments that said i would have gotten off the highway and been doing the speed limit the whole way home listen i would have sobered up I'm so saying. quick sobered up quick 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 listen i sober if i see blue lights in my rear room mirror much less and tweeting. that he was driving and tweeting so was she tweeting right when she got to this fucking accident that shit said tweet boom accident or like I want to. I just want to know like the timeline. Like, how I'm hoping time she tweeted it after the between, police walk off and she sit on lick a bit. I'm hoping. Yeah, I want to know what the timeline is between them driving the off, stop, yeah, and yeah. The, the, her coming and whatever, whatever, and that, and then you could look at that tweet and see what time she tweeted that, and really put that because that's crazy as hell. It's got to be what some minutes, like five to ten minutes, something, sir. 
That's fucking crazy, son. And now she fu- she fucked up. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. I just remember something I just saw. Babe said to me, the, the, this girl, man, got caught with all these drugs, bro. Oh, yes. Yes. You her? Dog. <laughs> Dog. <laughs> what y'all doing? What are y'all doing outside, huh? Outside. Yeah, them outside patrol. Outside gonna be clear as hell because y'all all gonna be going to jail. Yeah. <laughs> y'all all going to prison. Like, what the fuck? What the yeah, hell? They posted. What was it like? Fentanyl and. Yo, y'all gotta Every, chill with y'all. Everything you can y'all, think y'all, of. Y'all gotta chill with that shit, boy. I don't know. The fentanyl, the this, the that, the, mm, you know, all them stuff. 3.3 something million? Yeah. Oh. My thing is, Ooh, girl says she get she she don't she don't know whose car it was, or she gave them somebody the first name but not the last name. How about they said she was she was driving funny? They said she was driving funny. Yeah, like erratic. She dumb? was speeding or something. Are you dumb? Are Apparently, you dumb? are you dumb? This is why certain people can't be doing should not be doing certain certain lines of work are not made for certain people. Like, why are you driving crazy? That's the, you need to be the smoothest driver of your life that mm-hmm. day. Like, the smoothest. Legit. Like, again, you should be three, abiding. But then, like, the inner narco in me knows that <laughs> 3.3 something, somebody snitching. Mm-hmm. Okay? Mm-hmm. Okay? Yeah. 3. That's what somebody 3. said. Yeah. Somebody nah. was like, you're in a minivan and she looks innocent. Somebody yeah. called police. Yeah, somebody snitching. Yeah, that's a bit... Mm, you ain't gonna, mm-mm. she's still that's an idiot because why are you driving crazy to give it more whatever but definitely no, you make somebody it that shit hot. definitely snitch 3.3 just a bust on a, on a Tuesday on a yeah. Monday get the fuck out of here no somebody snitch mm-mm. 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 nah <laughs> y'all gotta be safe I don't know what the hell like I don't know I'm too afraid of Freddy. I'm afraid I, of everything. I think my anxiety I, be killing me. I, you know, you know, I have my ways, and I do, you know, my own shit. <laughs> but I am a law-abiding citizen for the most part. Like I, yo, um, that's a great movie, by the way. But yeah, yes, it's a good movie. I mean, <laughs> like I said, I do what I, my few things. I ain't got to know what those things. You are know, my damn business. you know, I, but, we've all had our little whatever, whatever. But, brush with but, justice. <laughs> the thing is, don't get caught. Talk. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Know who you know who you doing fuckery with? Facts. Know who you doing fuckery with? That's first and foremost. They don't. They know, never know who they doing fuckery with. That's the problem. Listen, my mom used to always tell me, like when we was like in high school, she's like, "Don't go to the store with nobody because if they teething and you with them, you going yep, to jail too. You going to jail too. Yep. And don't call me for nobody jail. <laughs> well, <laughs> <laughs> so you know what I'm saying, and like. And even with that, like, yeah, me there shop and somebody pick up two something, but then if I pick up our whatever, listen, I walk around by my business now. Mm-hmm. Listen, you get catch, me never know nothing. So huh? Me. What? Oh my gosh, <laughs> did they really? Oh no. <laughs> I would never have. <sighs> I would never. Friend no. Of me, friend of me business now. Like listen, that. listen, mm-hmm. all them something there. Listen, don't mm-hmm. get me started on the frenemies now. Mm-mm. Cause the people mm-hmm. them come and they come rope you up in a some fucker when they know Whoa, say you're not for you now. Look how my eye, I crutch me. Okay, like because all right. So back to um, listen. What's your name, Griselda? What's your name? The 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 smuggling girl, <laughs> right? Not Griselda. <laughs> <Ew>. <laughs> listen. Obviously, yeah. There's no way this was just a lucky day for the police officer. Thank you. There's no way this was just a lucky day for for them, no. right? No. Ida is an enemy. Know something that's going on, but yeah. even still, why would they know somebody in this operation? Yeah, think that they're cool with somebody and give somebody the information and yep. then call and say, Hey, Ray Tay Tay, this I keep exactly right, exactly. So now you put yourself in a position where that's fed time, big fed time. Actually, she's, didn't it? Was it a DEA? They called that was a DEA You're talking about like 40 years, you know. Oh, mm. you're talking like 40 years. Mm. Well, that's and that, sick. And that could be a joke I'm saying because it could be more than that. 3.3 million? All in one go. On you. And I you mean, ain't about to snitch because you know what. The, <laughs> don't play yourself. You have to go in some serious witness protection. <laughs> yeah, like, but she's all set. Like, she's. Yeah. What's she going to do? She going to snitch. Dog. 
She gonna snitch. Ain't no oh, way. She gonna snitch and get like but 15 honey, years. Point, yeah, but my thing is that ain't nothing to even play with because you know yeah. how that go. You finna sit for 40 years? We don't like them. St- okay, well, that's <laughs> 40 years or some stitches. Chef Picnic? 40 years or some stitches. I don't know what to tell you. Listen, I don't She know. might damn well have kids. She was driving like a minivan, wasn't she? Wasn't yeah. she? Yeah. But supposedly it wasn't her minivan and she only knew the person's first name and Dog. Oh man. I hope she don't got no kids, man. Cause that's I hope not. Because mama going to sing sing. <laughs> <laughs> For or real. She be sing sing it in the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, yeah, she all say. But I don't know. I don't... You think she'll snitch? Yeah. Me no know no. It don't look like she done did no hard time before. <laughs> she don't like but you can't judge a book by its cover. Oh, see, that's so, the, see, that's <gasps> speaking about books and book cover, go on. No, whoa, no. Whoa, I just, whoa. Bruh. I just, sorry. My name for the that. Sorry. Damn. What is your problem? Nah. I, I got some book covers I need to read to you because you're going to be like, what the fuck? But yeah, so it's just like, <laughs> dog. Who snitched? Like yo. somebody. <laughs> oh, no. It's some ghetto shit. It's some ghetto shit. Are they ghetto? Books? Like they ghetto, books? ghetto. Yes, you know oh, our so whole like urban fiction books. <laughs> Let's get it. My baby daddy's cousin want me and shit like that. Yeah. Oh, you have no idea. The hustler's cousin's mom. You don't have no idea. Oh, you gonna hear these titles? But before we get into these Fish titles, Fry Chronicles. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All that shit. All that. But yeah. But no. So we'll back around to that, right? Mm-hmm. Friend of me situation. Oh, my biggest thing, right, with calling people friends, yes, means a person. I don't use that word loosely, right? Like I might use it loosely, like just to say, "Oh yeah, my friend Retete," just because stopping to say, "Oh my associate" or somebody I know from X Y Z is gonna take a little bit longer than just say, "Oh my friend." But if I smiley, I'ma know, I'ma know. I understand. But like, mean. oh X Y Z, you know. Right, but to right. actually sit there and consider somebody my friend, it's no, right. So. <sighs> <laughs> How you feel about like friendship with mashup and comeback? Um, you believe in breakup to make up friendships? I believe in breakup to make up friendships. Yeah, yes, yes. If it makes sense, if the friendship is worth saving. No. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I mean, yeah. If, I mean, if the friendship is worth saving, I don't see why not. I understand that. Still. I don't see why not because people be ready to um break up to make up with their mind and all and their women and shit, but won't give their friend another chance. It don't make sense to me. I like that. It's quite I like, interesting I like how that. that works sometimes. Like you and your friend can't talk it out or whatever, but this man then cheated on you like fifty eleven mm. times, and you can forgive him every time. But you mm-hmm. and your friend have one disagreement. Bitch, get a grip. <laughs> The ones that oh. kill me is the ones that cheat with the friend and you're not talking to the friend no more, but you're going back with the man. Very crazy. Very crazy. Whoa. <laughs> very crazy. <But> no. <laughs> you know, my biggest thing with like friendship, well, any relationship, honestly, is communication, right? Right. Because mm-hmm. at the end of the day, if you and somebody so on our friend, right? Like mm-hmm. you should be able to communicate with each other. I right. know there's conversations that's hard and like sometimes you don't, you're not in the right mindset to have the conversation. You might need a little bit of space, blah, blah, blah. But I feel like- You if talking you were... about me? You talking about me? We can. Shit. No, 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 nigga. <laughs> no, no, nigga. We can't, nigga. What? You stupid. No, we cannot. <laughs> but you're saying it comes to you stupid. Hit dogs holler. Look at you. <laughs> but no, so freaking like when it comes to a point where it's like you feel like you're either too overwhelmed or whatever the case, you should be able to tell your friend, like, hey, give me a minute. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, not to even go in details. I feel the same way about, like, romantic relationships, too, even family. Because mm-hmm. I feel like at the end of the day, like, how I express myself right. is very important to me, specifically because, like, I don't want to say something that, like, I'm not comfortable saying in the moment because I'm either too worked up or whatever the case is. You get me? Yeah. So, like, if something happened, like, let's say me and you catch up or something happened, right? Mm-hmm. And I feel like, I really don't want to fuck with you right now. Okay. Like, I need some space. There's X, Y, Z going on in my personal life outside of our friendship. Right. Everything is just too much for me right now. Right? Okay. A simple A, I need a little space. Okay. 
and go on about your business, right? Okay, then. Now, my problem comes when people start acting funny. Oh, shit. And don't say nothing, right? Okay. Like, me and you are talking, we are catch up, da da da, we're gonna go eat lunch, and we're there, they are chill, and right there, next mm-hmm. day, blops nothing. I said, all right, probably having a day. I'm going to let you rock. Cool. All right. Next day I come, no. Nothing. Oh, shit. Like, morning and then not even dog. Just, just all right. Cool. Day three, no. And you know me with my fuckery. What's up? We broke up? Nigga be good? Like, what happened? Hear you. Hear you. Like, everything all right? Right. Now, that's your opening. Be real with me, because obviously I peep something is off. Like, <laughs> kick it to me. If Even if you're not ready, be like, oh, just give me some time. I need some space. All right, bet. I can rock with that. It's the bullshit that I don't really fuck with. Like, oh, no, everything's fine. We're great. No, da 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 All, All right. right, cool. Two there. Things seem like they might be back to normal a little bit. And then... Nothing again. <sighs> uh, now, I'm not saying I need to talk to my friends, all my friends, all day, every day. Because me and you not even talk every day. Like, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, okay, thank, thank you cool. for understanding. <laughs> like, okay, cool. But my thing is, like, if supposed to be friends with somebody, like, why are you, why are you being weird to me? Why like, being weird to me? <laughs> <laughs> like, if I do you something, tell me somebody do you something. But I tell myself a fuck saying, off. Do them something. It's just like, ugh, like I'm just over here. But with you know it. what's? But you know what's the weird thing though? When I accept it for what it is, and I start moving my way, and I don't care about it no more. Because the biggest thing for me is if you can't respect me enough to come to me and say, "Hey, this is what it is," I don't have no interest in communicating with you outside of whatever other business we got going on. Like if it's supposed to be a friendship, I like you. you know what I'm saying? It's kind of, that done for me. Oh shit. Like, it's a wrap. Like, because especially if I've addressed the situation and I'm like, yo, is everything good? Like, talk to me. Like, what's good? Like, we got a problem or what? And you're like, no, no, no. Everything's great. Mm-hmm. And then you acting like I friggin' slapped your mother. Like. Not slapped your mother. What? what? Like, real animosity. Like, weird, weird energy. Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So it's like. I hear you. I hear you. But the thing about it is that I'm not gonna try to like sound like a Leo, but mm. people always end up missing me oh, after shit. I stop giving a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> after I stop giving a fuck, they be like looking like they want to talk to me. How or big trying is to... your head right now, my nigga? How big is as your head? big as my hair? Anyways, oh, okay. <laughs> and if y'all know pointless, right? Y'all know how big her hair is, right? <laughs> so it's just like. Don't do that. Because mm. I don't do the back and forth thing. I'm not interested in like the, we not going to talk to each other. And all of a sudden we talking to each other again, like over some weird energy. Like if we just gradually like got space, that's understandable. But it's like a considered like deliberate effort. You can tell when something is deliberate versus like when you guys just gradually grow apart from each other. And I can always, always respect the gradual drift in, because shit. Things happen. People have lives, et cetera, et cetera. So it's like, I don't like that. You know, sometimes people just don't. They keep it meant like real short and just. I don't know. It doesn't work. Short for is one thing, though. Short is what I can short, respect. Short, short. Hell. And like not even okay, not even short. Let's not call it short. <laughs> Damn near nothing. Like you ghosted a friendship, basically. Yeah, not and I guess not on purpose. I guess. Oh no, it was done on purpose. Okay, that's that's where the issue comes in. Gotcha. Yeah. Gotcha. gotcha. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I see you. Yeah, <sighs> you know. Yeah, sip my liquor wine. But okay, we're gonna circle back around to the fuckery though, because mm-hmm. I feel like we've read one of this person's books. Or a couple of them. Who is it? Quan Mills. Have you have we read any of his Who books? Who is Quan Mills? What's the I don't title know. of the book? Can you see? I can't like see. Like the font? No, the font for the name. No? Okay. So. <laughs> no. 
he posted on his Instagram, right? <laughs> and was like, since things are being messy, basically, we can get messy with these novels, basically. Okay. <laughs> I just need you to listen to the names of these books. And okay. I hope they're jokes. I really hope they're jokes. You know it ain't no damn jokes. Pregnant by my sister's gay baby daddy. Hold on. Stop. <laughs> Pull up. No, 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 no. Hold on, love. Hold on. <laughs> Come again. Come again. Pregnant by my sister's gay baby daddy. Pregnant by my sister's gay baby daddy. So hold on, hold on. There's so many elements happening already. Pregnant by my sister's gay baby daddy. But, 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 pregnant. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. What the hell? So she and her sister are gonna have cousin Pitney. Yeah, but okay, but obviously they're gonna that be cousin that brothers that coming from a woman. Obviously, because you say you're pregnant. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. then you saying the man is gay, so bisexual. Then the hell going on okay but can you see the image they use though for Peanut the butter jelly <laughs> you can't see it look yo what is yeah the covers be wild <laughs> on them books yo them urban fiction books bro okay so the next one no yeah sleeping with my baby mama's mama's baby daddy sleeping with my baby mama's baby daddy my baby mama's mama's. So the baby mother, so the picnic grandmother. Nah, wait. See, that's some little <laughs> shit. I, I can't even understand it. All right. So wait. Sleeping Hold with on. my baby's mama's mama's baby daddy. So wait. Are your, are your baby mother father you all sleep with? Mm -hmm. I don't matter. I have our next baby father. Oh, shit. Maybe her boyfriend or some shit like that. But it's at the baby mother's mother baby father okay so then her baby daddy so maybe she got another kid that's maybe not the girl man i don't fucking know it sounds it's messy though man <laughs> so the next one no pregnant by my granddaddy's boyfriend hear me out what the fuck <laughs> say that shit. hear me wait hey bro say bro say pregnant, that again pregnant say that by again. my <laughs> Say that shit again, nigga. Say that again. Pregnant by my granddaddy's boyfriend. Oh, that shit's stressful. That's a stressful one right there. All right. The next one, no. The no, last no, one. No, 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 no. No, one more. One nah, more. Nah, no, no. We, no, no, no. <laughs> this one isn't as complicated. No, 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 no. <laughs> Take your time. Please. Go ahead. <laughs> Sleeping with my baby daddy's boyfriend. <laughs> what is happening here? I just want to know why all of them have a gay theme. Because that is that person is the writer gay, maybe? Perhaps. We're about to find out. Quan Mills. Let me go. Has he had this, some man. interesting situations in his life? I'm curious. Because that's it's hmm. Yeah, that sounds a little bit too mixy, man. Way too mixy. But there's, it's feeling. like mixy. They're all mixy at the same time, but they all lead back to a certain element, right? He's from Miami. The same he's from where? Miami. Of course he is. Well, he no lives shade. in Chicago. No shade. I don't want you to get on here. Well, rah, 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 he shop. lives between oh, yeah, no, Miami people. Because <laughs> y'all like to tussle. <laughs> okay. Okay. And I'm not with all of that. <laughs> Riff rap, y'all. <laughs> he lives between Chicago and L.A. Mm. He's known for his gritty, graphic, and gut-punching urban tales that depict the real and rawness of black urban life. No. Mm. Pastors eat pussy too. What the fuck? Hold on. I mean, they do. <laughs> but what's going on? That's the name of one of his books. They sure do. So oh, I look hear. at the picture. No, no. I'm look saying it like I know what the fuck. <laughs> oh, my God, no. I didn't you mean to You want me that. to cover this shit? Don't play with me. What's this? <laughs> I don't want to see it. Is it at the pew? Oh my gosh. No, it's not. <laughs> is it at the pew? Is Here you. Pew? Look. I'm sick of it. <laughs> I'm sick of it. I'm sick of it. No. And these are and these and these are these books are out now or are they Yeah, this is this one is one that, those he said are coming soon, but this one that I just came up with. Not coming at, soon. <laughs> what? Not Shut coming up. Soon. What the hell? <laughs> Ho yo coochie stank? What I'm, no no no. A bacterial vaginosis love listen, story. Listen, here's where I cut you. Okay? 
Here's where I cut you. Don't worry about it. Here's where I cut you. Absolutely not, my nigga. <laughs> Big stop sign. This is where I cut you off. Um, Addicted to the abortion clinic? Yo! No. What? What? This is the same guy? Yes! These are his books that are actually out. Now for research. Where can I find these books? Research purposes. <laughs> Let me send you the link. Wanna, I want to know if they are as crazy as, you know what I'm saying? Is it just to pull in people like, oh, this sound crazy. You know what I'm saying? A certain, you know, demographic. If you, <laughs> I mean, it says, you know, they, hmm. Get to business. Is this Quan Mills? Telling my business. What's this? <laughs> Is this him? This high yellow thing. I'm done. Not high yellow. With his tongue all out. I need to see what this man looked like. Cause now I'm I'm curious. Are you really? Wow. It said like Quan Mills is white. You <laughs> with a whole bunch of mess just now. Okay. And yes. how did you um how did you happen to bump into um these books? <laughs> if you don't mind me asking. On Instagram. Like a like a somebody's in somebody page or something like that or I, one of them ad, or one I of think them ads. It was actually his Instagram. Somebody posted it from his page and posted it to their story. I think it was Ro actually. I think it was Ro who posted the book cover. If it wasn't you, Ro, I'm sorry, but somebody posted it to their story. <laughs> I feel like that's something Ro would post though. <laughs> but. <laughs> Mm-mm. This white hoe put raisins in the potato salad. No, no, no. What the f <laughs> listen, 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 listen. I'm gonna need you to chill out. No for real. I'm gonna need you to just <laughs> <laughs> what? No. This is so Yeah, I don't know about all that. No. Friend, I don't know. Yeah, that's a lot. I don't know, friend. That's a lot. Mm -hmm. Crack whole dreams. I'm done with you. But <laughs> I'm done with you in these books. Just send me the link and I'm going to look into it. I think so I sent it to you so on WhatsApp. I so I can let the people know what's going on next time. Mm -hmm. I'm just, you going to read them? I'll see about it. I'll see about it. But what else has gone? A mess. What else has going on or happened recently? Um... I can't think about anything. However, did you see that? That's um, not good. <laughs> yeah. Um, so one of them Instagram reels. They tried to do like a little TikTok or whatever. Okay. And a lady went to Dungeon River Balls and she was sitting there twanging. And they tried to charge her the um, foreigner price. Oh, and shit. then she switched back. She switched back to um. They love to do <laughs> to that to Patois. people. But this is my thing, though. You twang when you in Jamaica? Who? Cool. You. Um, not really. Okay. Because I feel like I don't think any Jamaican not goes really. to Jamaica and, hello, good evening. Yes, I am here and to purchase. Um, speak is spooky business. Yo, I hate that so much. Like, if you speak in standard English, speak standard English. But the, the oh, oh, I want to buy three tickets for your Dungeon River Balls um, experience. <laughs> Y'all what? <laughs> yeah, pay the six hundred and something dollars. Yo, yes. why are you so crazy? <laughs> <laughs> like, ma'am, why are you why are you talking like this? I'm dead. No. Why? <laughs> like, mm -mm. stop mm. it. Uno for tapi. <laughs> like, I go home and I psh, listen. I try not to speak English. If I if I talk at all, okay, I'm letting mm -hmm. other people talk for me. Because first of all, they can smell. Fire and Pamela will come. True. So <laughs> I'm not even trying to say nothing. Don't don't talk to me. Mm -mm. No, Daddy, where's my father? Father, come handle my affairs, please. Thank you. <laughs> that video was from like recent, like recent, recent. It was a skit. It was one of them little TikTok skit something. Okay. Yeah. So I, it wasn't a real thing, but it okay, was just so like, like a joke thing. Mm hmm. But I, I was like, just I like, like still, and I like still. Yeah. But yes. listen, if you're twang, then we'll try you. Yeah, because I walk with my, my Jamaican passport when I went to Dunderville Falls. Yeah, Because like, yeah, I was like, yeah, don't yeah, play yeah, with yeah. 
yeah, yeah, do yeah, not, yeah. do not. <laughs> me, I'm a two looking sister. Them go. I said, oh, I'm, I said, um, let me get tree for um resident. Yeah. <laughs> she said, you have um ID. I said, hmm, see it, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Don't yeah, play yeah. with me, lady. Do not <laughs> <laughs> find somebody else around. Put me not pay on the extra price. Them for yeah, come yeah, come yeah. for a foreign. No man. I hear you. Just ready to get crass, no ye. <laughs> Jeez. You know, say pity them there. Don't don't do that. You look like me have money? No, I'm not the money. Mm-mm. Yeah, you look like money bags enough. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. You look like money bags enough, friend. No man. Jano. Just a regular degular, you know? Jano. <laughs> so Yes. This topic. <laughs> Which topic this now? Somebody um mm. tweeted the other day, right? Mm. How they're afraid to travel with their sex toys Man. because of TSA. <laughs> my gosh, bro! Oh my gosh, this is like my life here <laughs> that you're talking about. I just would like to know. I feel like we might have talked about this before, but the fact that it keeps happening, I would like to know what the purpose is. Do you I really think I have know. a weapon in my bag? This shit is crazy. I man, for you talking to somebody that gets stopped with a toy and without a toy. I don't know what it is. Mm-mm. I don't know what it is with me and they must love me or something, but it's something they must but, like you. But when that toy does come, it does create quite the, uh, the stir excitement. Yeah, they like to act so immature and shit. They stop. They could clearly see the shape and, and what it is. Like I know you see my dick in the bag, bro. You are so much better than me because I would embarrass them no, every I, single I don't time. Have time for all that shit, like I don't have time for all that shit. Because I'm sitting there like, looking oh, at you like no, that shit, nice, time, huh? Maybe like, do you want to um, go? Be- do you want to go behind like closed doors or do you want to do it right here? No, do it right here. I'm not ashamed. It's just my. Dick. <laughs> I got a problem with this shit. Like, let's do this now. Open it. You see, it's a dick now. Close back my stuff. And yes, in here acting immature. Then they be looking at each other and kicking like, oh my gosh, like, y'all okay? You see like, it, right? You see it, yeah. great. Now close my shit and give it back. Thanks. I don't understand the excitement. Like, what is the purpose? What know. is the purpose? I don't know. Maybe because it's big, bro. <laughs> hey, wait, it's a friend. <laughs> Maybe because it's big. What? I don't I'm know. a sister. You feel me? It's in the jeans. Anyway. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> like I said, it's in the jeans. You a it mess. Is. Yes. But um okay, I'm about to... don't be afraid. Like, don't even be afraid. Bring your shit. And I mean, if they happen to stop you, be like, well, bitch, here's my vibrator, bitch. Or here's my my dildo, whatever y'all using and all that stuff. My rose, my whatever. Mm-hmm. Like, this is what it is. You know what it is. And just move along. Don't feel no way. Like it's natural. Like you're going on vacation. Like I'm gonna want to tickle my shit. Or I got some shit to be doing. Like, mind your damn business. Like, it's nothing. Like don't feel no way about your toys. They're your toys. Like you grown. My thing too, though, right? Like my toys got batteries, like rechargeable batteries. And it's like lithium ion. And you know, you're supposed to really like travel, like fly with those, like whatever. So I'd be wondering like, what's like the max you can bring <laughs> um, on the airplane before it's a problem? Because I would honestly be the asshole that calls the airline and asks them, hey, can I see the customer <laughs> service? Can I agent, please? Agent, agent, agent. Thanks. Okay. I have a question for you. Um, how many vibrators can I bring on your flight and dildos? Like, is there a, like is there a is limit? there a restriction? <laughs> like, I mean, yeah, just I mean, because I'll be damned if y'all take yeah. confiscate my toys at this fucking TSA. This is what I'm saying. Pissed. This is what I'm saying. Especially if I'm bringing like the good shit, like, bitch. I'll be pissed. Girl. Just what? Get, you, get you like some vacation versions of like your toys, and just in case. You don't lose them. It's a so good you idea. Got them at home. I get some backup toys. I do have one that's like a duplicate of. That's what I'm saying. Get one. you like a backup toy, and then you could bring the other oh, vacation just in case it get lost or it break. Yeah, hello. <laughs> but you know how it goes some time. And um, yeah, and then you come that's home. A you good still idea. Got the, you still got the good shit. That's a good idea. Yeah. yeah. Okay. See, so I'm like talk to you. You know, you have like a sense and thing. So yeah. <laughs> Boy, I can't, I can't stand you, bro. Can't stand you. Whoa. Hold on. I got to talk shit. The, I don't Uh-oh. know. So, I saw something that I didn't really. All right. So, 
you know, y'all know how I how I feel about feet. Come on, right, mm-hmm. right, right. Everybody mm-hmm. know how I feel about feet. Mm-hmm. But all right, I don't. You want snowfall? You ain't shit. <laughs> all right. So no, I'm not even no, but I'm coming at it from a Wait, different, hold on. different way, right? I I haven't. I'm not caught up, but I I feel like I know what you're talking about. Go ahead though. So the character has a girlfriend, and they had like. A picture of her foot was going around from one of the episodes. And I mean, mm-hmm. like, you know, they feet. Everybody's feet ain't pretty. So, but, like, I felt bad because I was like, damn, I don't even like feet like that. But y'all ain't got to be out talking about people and stuff. It made me feel a way. <laughs> it made me feel a way. I felt bad. <laughs> Did and you? I, I felt bad. For her? I felt, I felt bad because I was like, damn, her. it's just her feet. Like, y'all just, and some of y'all, what, like, what's the problem? Yeah, I felt bad. I felt bad. Like, I, I, feel, think- like she was, I feel like she was being bullied. Oh yeah, that's not cool. That's what I'm I saying. Didn't I didn't see like she was being bullied based on like that one nothing. still. That's what I'm saying. And like her whole role, right? You're supposed to be focusing on one shit. They focus they're calling her ugly too and all this stuff. That's what I really Oh no. Yeah, they really going at her and saying like she's ugly. They're like, wow, like for the character to be who it is, this is who he wants. So from Yeah, you know, they picking her apart from the hair to the feet. Oh to wow the face. It's kind of rough. It's kind of rough. Okay, so did you watch that episode with the foot? Yeah, I seen it. Her foot really looked like that in the video. Like, that's... come on, man. No, I'm asking because I've only seen the still, and I'm like, it looked like it was like at a weird angle. It's because she they was laying on the floor, and she kind of was, you know, like twist, you know, like oh, foot, foot like, twist up, know, foot, but, yeah, but oh, okay. <laughs> the internet the internet is not a nice place no man i yeah and people look like people have gotten meaner man i got yes you, like in the past like two three years people have gotten meaner i see like these comments like social media how people say certain things they don't have no just fingers just like twitter fingers oh and, yeah you know, ig on the people come like stuff just saying whatever you just be like yo mm-hmm. these mother is crazy like I feel like you're trying to bring back the time before PC, but it's like y'all are doing y'all are just being mean at this nice. point. Like y'all not even being cute and funny or witty. Y'all are just being fucking assholes. But it's like, nice because they want to be mean, but at the same time they want to cancel everybody and at the same yes. time they want to be hella sensitive too. Pick one. It's very crazy because there was a time where certain shit we could joke about certain shit and niggas wasn't so damn sensitive. Now you say certain shit, you getting canceled for it. Like it can't mm-hmm. even be a joke no more. Call it what the fuck you want. Call it ignorant, whatever. But I know there was a time where we know certain shit could be said. I watch, we watch shows like from mm-hmm. back in like the nineties and shit. And we hear some of the jokes and we'd be like, yo, Whoop. if this show can't was say that shit now, today <laughs> it would have been canceled. All this shit happening. But then at the same mm-hmm. time they have, a, I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm at a weird space with, you know. Yeah, I can't. Whatever's going on right now. They want to be this, but then they can bully. They be on there talking shit all day. People threatening people. (sighs) Yeah, I just, listen, pick a side and stand on it. Like, I don't understand. (sighs) Social media is a wormhole. Yeah. Social media is so crazy. If you let it grab you, son, it can really pull you down. Yes. Because I know a lot of people who, like, have to take hiatuses from social media because it's becoming, like, too much. And yeah, I've never, like, had to do, like, an advertised hiatus. Like, if anything, I just be like, I'm just not going to log on. Right. (laughs) I just won't open the app. Like, I'm not going to be like, I'm going to be gone for some time, guys. Yeah, they'd love to make an announcement. Oh, we'll miss you. Oh, blah, blah, blah. Bitch, get your ass off here and deactivate for a second. (laughs) Like, don't nobody care about all that stupid shit. (laughs) <laughs> so somebody can tell you no no don't go don't leave don't go i'm here if you need me man yeah <laughs> yeah. yeah i just mm-mm. i'm not with it i'm not with either one of like it's draining honestly like a lot of time and like the other day i was like you know what i'm gonna just start reading my books again yo I just got a book and I am, yes, I got a word search and another book. It's, yes. it's like positive, you know, good stuff. Um, mm-hmm. You know, you know, you're working on, you know, personal development and all these things. Yeah. So it's it's really good. Yeah. I'm trying to get back into books and all that because. Mm-mm. Yeah. Mm-mm. Yeah. I'm not feeling it at all. 
Yeah, no. And she just made me feel like, I don't want to be a part of this. Like, I'm going to come on, promote All what I promote. All the time, dog. All the time. I'd be feeling like, yeah, I'd be like, yep, going to just go ahead and log right out of this here. Because I don't. I, it's like I log on. I'd be like, oh, this is, I'm tired. Let me click off this. Because I'm tired of what the f- is going on or something ignorance going on or mm-hmm. something stupid going on. Like, where is the fucking good news, bro? Not that to say, part. Not, not to say whatever. Let me let me stop. Because like, I'm grateful for my life and blessings and everything and yes. family and friends and everybody's healthy and we're all doing great. But, like, with the world itself is my issue. Mm-hmm. You don't hear nothing, no good news about the world. Like, nothing. Like, boom. Is that COVID gone? What? World you know War Three? Nobody can give you that confirmation of none of that shit. Nobody, nobody. I don't know what the fuck going on with these people over here fighting in the war and shit. I don't even know what the hell going on because I, I tuned out. I know that UPS isn't shipping to Russia right now. And I know, I think FedEx isn't shipping in or out of Ukraine. One bugger fuckery. Shit like that. Can I hear like, oh, that shit is done. It's done. We, they've reached some kind of peace. Some kind of something. I just want some good news. Mm-hmm. Damn. Up, oh, COVID got up and walked away. We don't know. She disappeared and we don't know where she at. Listen, that I was in a grocery great. store on Monday and I was like the only person with a mask on. I was like, oh, y'all got me God. fucked up. <laughs> I know I got on this thing last time. I told y'all to wear your mask. Mm-hmm. Please wear your mask still. Me, I'm not going to play with you. Me and mine, we're going to wear our mask still. I don't care. Mm-hmm. Vaccinated, I'm like, whatever, don't matter what, whatever. If you take the joke, if you never take the joke. As a matter of fact, I'm not telling nobody to wear their shit. That's y'all business. Y'all grown anyway. Y'all ain't gonna listen to me. If I dirt, I dirt. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Uh, half of y'all said that shit wasn't it wasn't around, it still ain't around, it didn't never happen. So you're not gonna listen. So be easy. People think it never happened. Girl, you got people to this day that believe that this shit was never a thing. Like, it was nothing. Like, it did not exist. Like, it was just a cold. Like, COVID was not a thing. I wish it was just a cold. I I think about that shit, and I think about how the fuck I felt when I had... Man. And I I really think about these people, and I'm just like, yo, like... How fortunate for you. To just be in such... No. Like, what kind of denial are you... You're going to need help in a few. Yeah. You're going to need help. Because that different... Like, <laughs> Nigga, excuse me, what? Like, yeah, people just be like, that should ain't even happen, man. It was da-da-da-da. Okay. What strain are you smoking? Please let me know. Bruh. Like. Bruh. The best shit ever. <laughs> Why Speaking of strains, you smoking mm-hmm. them? <clears throat> no. Oh, okay. Sorry. Wow. I almost <laughs> I almost hit the blunt the other night, but Y'all. I was like, nope. <laughs> Still waiting. I know. I think if you like an OG listener, you know that she don't smoke. You know, I'm the herbalist of the two of us, and I don't know how to get. I don't know. I'm not trying to, you know, peer pressure, peer pressure, and all that shit. But I mean, like niggas like the splizzy, so I like the spliz, bro. <laughs> the splizzy. <laughs> Um, it would have to be a weekend or something. I don't Greg, know. Like I just... when, bro? Like, come on. Like, come pack up your bag and pan and get <laughs> snacks. Come on to the crib. And we're going to set the little mood. It's going to be good. Y'all hear this? Yes, dog. <laughs> like, we're going to set the mood. We're going to have the munchies, the good this, the whatever brownies. I told you. You know how we get down. Somebody offered me shrooms. <laughs> and I was like, I don't even smoke weed. Are you serious? My thing is. Did you at least take them so you could bring them? No, to no, you didn't. Wow, Mm-mm. it'd be your own friends. <laughs> they was offering friends. me like they didn't pull it out. They was just like they just mentioned it, and I was like, "Shoot, nothing. You want some?" And I was like, well, "They offer again. You go ahead and get a little baggy and catch them for me, thanks." I got you. I got yeah, yeah. you. You need to do that too. Just saying. Shrooms are. I'm gonna go read my book Shrooms and cool. sip my wine. I believe you. I've listen. I have been asking everybody. Like you know this. I have been asking literally everyone since you've told me about you know the joys, and I'm like, <laughs> how was your experience? And they've all given me good Amazing. results. Yes. And I'm just like, oh, that's so nice. I'm happy for you. Obviously, <laughs> people do things at your own um, discretion, and um, yes, know what doses you're taking and how much you're taking and who you're doing it with. And, you know, make sure you're safe and, you know, all that shit. Literally, everyone told me I should microdose. <laughs> I I have been looking into the whole microdose thing. I would like to do it, but I need to find, guess what? Ding, ding, ding. A supplier, somebody who got shrooms. 
<laughs> I need to okay. find someone who has shrooms. Point taken. Just Speaking of, I need Speaking to find someone. One more time, I need to find someone who has shrooms. We are in no way um, encouraging the use of psychedelics or marijuana. You make these decisions on your own. We are not promoting. You anything. said we're not encouraging. Oh, okay. I'm not promoting the use of. <laughs> Live your life. Don't tell nobody that pointless talks made you do it because I did not. Oh. No. Coming a while, no go do nothing. I'm gonna fuck up and go carry on with fuck with people and no. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Out here oh. licking frogs and shit. Whoa, no. whoa, whoa. <laughs> licking frogs? <laughs> or toads. That's supposed to give you a buzz also if you like find the, the right like one. The fun, like the right one? Mm-hmm. Oh. I don't think I want to do that. Mm-mm. No, just run me the shrooms. Yeah. But you need to do that. We're going to do that. And we're going to be like, man, you playing. Yeah. yeah. You're so funny. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's funny? Somebody asked me, somebody out of state actually asked me if I have a plug here for weed. And I just couldn't stop laughing. I was like, I don't smoke. And they were right. like, oh, yeah, that's right. But I feel like, I don't know, you might know, you know, like. And I just started laughing because I legit... I was just like, I'll see what I can find out. Yeah. I was like, I don't do drugs. Why are you asking me where to find drugs? Stop it. Like, <laughs> do I look like the type of person that knows people who do drugs? Like, no. <laughs> no, no, not at all. No, not you. <laughs> not you. <laughs> but mm-mm. it's past my bedtime. Uh oh. Yeah, listen, at, y'all know what that means. Everybody, <laughs> people, y'all know what that means. <laughs> Black people know exactly Lift what up. that means. <laughs> wow. Mm, it's past my bedtime. Yeah, it's after one. It's been an hour or two. Yeah, look at us. No, yeah. that after the past time, you know, you like, dang. Ooh. Mm, it's getting, getting late. late. <laughs> mm. Start yawning. Stretch. stretch. Damn, it's getting late. You're like, oh, what you got to do tomorrow? What you about to do? <laughs> oh, that's early. You got to get up early. You might want to go ahead and start getting home, baby. <laughs> Like it's dark outside. You sure you gonna Our be all right? Just be like, oh, I got an early start in the morning. I gotta get up at like four thirty. Like <laughs> <laughs> you and who? Jesus. Mm-hmm. Listen, I gotta get up four thirty to pee and go right back to sleep. Knock out is what I mean. That's me. Exactly. Mm-mm. All right. Well, since that means you have to tell people them good night. So say we want to say all these things. All right. So make Run sure to ultra. follow us. <laughs> Run the outro. I should record that shit too. Um, make sure you follow us on all the social media things. Mm-hmm. Um, for Dem Sugar, it is Lion Young V on Twitter, and on Instagram, it is Dem Sugar underscore D E M S U G A underscore. In case I don't ever know how to spell it. Mm-hmm. Um, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, all the things, all the streaming outlets iHeartRadio, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, Spotify, SoundCloud, Deezer, yep. everything, Castbox, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Mm-hmm. Um, it's Pointless Talks, P O I N T L E S S S T A L K S. You can send questions and whatever to askpointless at gmail.com. Mm-hmm. Um, mom, 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 mom. We got buttons. We got some buttons with like the new logo on there, the little mouth with the little flags or whatever. Um, promo, y'all can't see. Promo, I'm here pointing on promo, the shit. I'm promo. pointing at stuff y'all can't see. Um, um, they are on the website. It's pointlesstalks.com slash crafts. I know it's not something I created, but who cares? That's the website. Go find it. Go listen. Go click. Buy That's stuff. Rough for the people themselves. Jesus. Sorry. Some of them like it rough though. Wow. Ow. But um, but yeah, thank you for listening. And just like every other episode, whether you got here on purpose or by fate, thank you so so much for listening to this episode of Pointless Talks. Bless up, people. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>